Hello and thanks for watching this Cloud9 ERP Solutions video and subscribing to our YouTube channel. In this series of videos of Acumatica 2024 R2, we're going to talk about a new feature that allows you to manually create project performance without having to go through the project and have it lead the way. So here we are looking at a project. It's a construction electric project. And when we take a look at this project, we scroll down to the bottom, you can see that there's a feature turned on called Proforma Invoicing on Billing. This allows you to create a draft invoice that your customer can review and then kick back to you with feedback, and which is typical in construction projects where there's an evaluation done as to how much of the project can be billed at any given time. Now in this project, if we go over to invoices, you can see that no invoices have been created for this project yet. If we go over to the revenue budget and we take one of these tasks, you can see all the tasks and their original budgets and everything, and we decide that our general requirements, we've completed 25% and maybe our warranty fees are 50%. This will create a pending invoice amount. And this is how we create our invoice from the project, our pro forma invoice in this case. So if we were to run our billing, Acumatica creates an invoice based on our progress and the progress complete that we've entered into the project. And you could see that here. If we scroll over to the right, it shows the amount we're trying to invoice for this project on these particular line items. And that's great. Additionally, any time and material tasks that you have, so for example, any time and material activities, any transactions that hit the project and therefore have formulas to bill out to the customer, those time and material transactions would also show up here. But let's say we delete this. We go back, we'll delete it. Now what we can do in 2024 R2 is we can create a new pro forma invoice. Now we're left on that invoice screen since we deleted it. However, if we go to construction and we go to pro forma invoices and click new, we get the same screen. And now from this screen, we can select the project and we can key in our progress billing or time and materials. So we can pick our account group in this case, labor, select our project task. So be general conditions. And then we can go over here and select the amount that we want to manually invoice. Now this will update the project, but we're doing it at an invoice level instead of from the project. Additionally, we can also add time and material transactions to this invoice. So we'll select our project task. We have cost codes here, so we'll select this is general requirements. We're going to bill out two hours at $85 an hour and we'll save it. So now what you have is some progress billing. So we're pulling from a task on the original project and we're deciding to bill out 25,000 against it. Additionally, we have $170 in time and material. And now what you can do is remove the hold. And if you have approvals turned on, you can go through the approval process and then release it. And now what you can see when you go back to the project under invoices, you could see that pro forma invoice is attached to the project. And now you can keep track of it despite the fact that you created it manually. So that's the ability to create a manual pro forma invoice against a project. Thanks so much for watching this video, and if you found it useful, please click the like button. And if you have any questions about this or anything else Acumatica, feel free to reach out to us. We'd love to hear from you. Thanks again, and have a great day.